What's up everybody? Welcome back to another movie review. Today we are talking about War for the Planet of the Apes. The third movie in the Planet of the Apes trilogy, the second for Matt Reeves directing. Um, I think as, as far as Matt Reeves directing goes, I think I like Dawn of the Planet of the Apes more. I think it's just more visceral. Um, as far as this one goes, it's still astonishing to me that Andy Serkis is walking around in pajamas and yet the detail that they make him look into Caesar the ape, you know what I mean? Like the, the CGI to me is astonishing, you know, I can't wrap my head around how they end up from CGI pajamas to Caesar the furry ape and, you know, they have proper lighting on him and everything you know it's just so it looks so good in like the war apes i think that's why i like dawn of the planet of the apes better really it's just the opening shot with caesar with the war paint on his face and him going to the city and telling them to stay there and the woods are ape home human home you know like it was just it was incredible but it was also coming off of rise of the planet of the apes which had Caesar speaking at the very end. So, like, this second movie was, like, them getting into talking apes and shit. This third movie, there, there's talking apes. You know, like, we're we're past the fact that apes can talk. And now we're on to the, the fact that the apes are taking over the planet. And the people aren't happy about it. The people want their planet back. And the apes just want to live in peace in the woods. But apes like Koba wanted to kill the people and the simian virus is killing people and you see how like with the little girl um in maurice the giant orangutan i, I really like that big giant orange orangutan he's the best um but he you know and he's like we can't take her i understand but we can't leave her either and he couldn't at least so they take the little girl and she must be they didn't really explain it but like they she must be sick at some point because she's alive, but she can't speak. So they lose like their vocal cords or something. And the same thing happens to Woody Harrelson's character. And they keep leaving soldiers behind and shooting them and shooting their own people and leaving them. And they keep moving. So like the, the disease must still be around and still be affecting people. But now it's not killing them and it's just making them lose their voice. Um, so then they have to learn sign language or whatever, but... I don't know. It, it, I would be curious on what's happening to the people more in maybe a fourth movie, a rumored fourth Planet of the Apes movie called Kingdom of the Planet of the Apes. That would be Matt Reeves' trilogy. And the third movie in that movie would, I think, be his real capper, right? Because this movie seemed more like it's, it's, it was supposed to be the third of the trilogy, but this movie to me seemed more like the midway point you know like there's more crazy shit that's come to come but the way this movie ends it could it could all end right there because the way they end it you know caesar kind of just rolls leans over to his side and either takes a big rest and he's fine or he's dead you know and then they have to carry on with cornelius his son or whatever but i would like to see andy circus back personally uh woody harrelson as a villain solid um, I, I did really like him in this role with the bald guy, except he kills the wife and his other son, the one that got attacked by the bear, you know, so that little things like that, like I was like, oh, I wouldn't have killed them off so quick, you know, like it was like the main, like just starting of the movie and like kill them off. I'm like, fuck, it's terrible. But overall, uh, four out of five stars, eight out of 10. I really enjoyed this movie, you know, 2017. I don't think I saw it in theaters, but I do remember really liking this movie. I don't think it's streaming anywhere. Thank God I had the DVD and I watched it last night. But I really enjoyed the Planet of the Apes trilogy, especially this most recent one. Comment below if you have any recommendations for me on movies I should watch next. Um, if there's older Planet of the Apes movies I should watch, please leave the titles of those down in the description below. Um, I, I feel like I have seen some of those. But it's definitely been a long time. I might have been forced to watch some of those, if you know what I'm saying. So, like, yeah. Uh, going back and watching movies that you want to go rewatch instead of somebody making you watch them, 
just feels a little, a little bit better once you see them and you're like, yeah, I chose to watch this, so I'm gonna try to enjoy it, you know? Like, I hate the people that watch shit and just want to hate things. I'm like, no, I would rather watch something and come in optimistic, wanting to like it, and if it doesn't meet my expectations, oh well. But I'm not just gonna, like, simmer at hate, you know? Come in with your emotions up here, and then if they don't meet them, then, you know, you feel middle about it. You don't feel just... Oh, I think I'm gonna hate this and then you hate it the whole way through and you're just angry and hateful That's just nobody wants to be around that if you're a hateful person goodbye, you know, like Just change it's it's possible everyone can change so, you know, if you're hating change if you are open and optimistic to things Hey, welcome to the channel because that's what I'm like, you know I want to just try new things watch things. I haven't seen in a long time review them talk about them That's all it's about, you know Talking about shit that I'm into and hoping you guys are into it too. Maybe you guys are into stuff and you can put me onto some cool shit. So looking forward to seeing your comments in the comment section below. If you want to email me some recommendations, comicallyboston at gmail.com. You can hit me up there. Links down in the description below. Hit Look me up on Letterboxd see what other movies I've been reviewing. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.